Hey, good morning, everyone. This is Mark Joshua. Uh, I'm, I'm here at my, uh, just at my time with the Lord, and the Lord really spoke to my heart with a bite-sized word. And He said, um, "Don't do not focus on a building, but focus on building up the body of Christ in an apostolic way, and that Jesus longs for a spotless bride like never before." I think we need to be uh, reformed. I, I think 2020 happened. Uh, there was a reformation going on. It's still going on. There's a lot of shaking, but also to reform us more into the image of Jesus, first of all, but also uh, um, to reform us in the way we, uh, our perspective on being church and how church need, ought to be. And the Lord told me that, um, you know, for also for our, our, myself personally and our ministry uh, we're looking at a building for some events but the main focus should always be the, the apostolic way of building up the body of Christ and uh, the Lord gave me these verses um, in the first Corinthians uh, chapter 3 it says that Paul built like a like a skillful architect uh, like a, build, a skillful builder he built he laid the foundation and uh, th that foundation is Jesus Christ, the anointed one. And then he says that be careful how you build on this foundation. That it always, always should be, um, the foundation should always be Jesus Christ and not anything else than him. And then the Lord also gave me this verse from, um, it's in John 21, where um, Jesus asked Peter, do you love me? And uh, he, he asked this uh, three times and Jesus starts, um, Jesus, um, Peter was very affected by it. And, and then he said, oh, Jesus, you know that I love you. And then Jesus says, feed my, feed my sheep. I think uh, as a church, uh, we need to know that God wants to have reformation. He wants revival, but also reformation. And this reformation is so important for us to realize because of this reformation, we can become more and more that, sp um, that spotless bride that he wants, uh, a spotless bride that's holy and prepared for Jesus to pick her up but also the way we do church or we see church is very important and that reformation is needed, is so needed for us to be more effective, to be more effective as a church in this world, but also be um, more effective in making true disciples for Jesus Christ, also being more effective in, in, uh, in shining our light in the, in the darkness. So, um, I just want to share this bite-sized word with you all. Um, let's focus on building uh, the, up the body of Christ in an apostolic way. And th this apostolic way is really like, like Paul described it, like an architect. He, he had a vision for how the church should be and he built that, but it was always the foundation of Jesus Christ. And uh, if you have an apostolic calling uh, in your life, um, you you also would know that you get a vision of how you're gonna build, and that vision that the foundation should always be Jesus Christ. But that vision can be um, uh, can be more clear, you know. Um, if you if your heart is to build up the body of Christ, I think there's a blessing on it. But if your if your heart is just to um, create, you know, have a building, have a, st a certain kind of status, um, that shouldn't be your, your intention. Your intention should be to lay the foundation of Jesus Christ so that he can have his spotless bride, so that he can uh, feed his uh, sheep uh, through us. So that's so important also for me. I also, as a pioneer, I also um, um, take notice of this every time I check my heart. So um, I want to encourage all of you all, uh, all of you um, in 2021, let's focus on building up the body of Christ in an apostolic way uh, so that, so that uh, Jesus can have his spotless bride. And also be encouraged for these times ahead, you know, because um, we're living in amazing times. We're going to shine our light like, like, light like never before. 
the darkness is increasing, but the light of, uh, of the body of Christ is also increasing. So uh, be encouraged. Uh, I pray that uh, the Holy Spirit will guide you in, 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 in more revelation of who Jesus is and the foundation that we have to lay um, for him and, and that, that he will become that foundation in Jesus Christ's name. May the grace of our master Jesus Christ the extravagant love of our Father God and the intimate friendship of the Holy Spirit be with you all. Uh, love and shalom in Yeshua and see you next time. Bye-bye.